Hey guys, I just wanted to talk about the Dow Jones Industrial Average. And I wanted to talk about this. We've had a double top right here. We've also descended down into a, a triangle, but it looks like we've broken out of the descending triangle. And it appears we are really reaching for this 30,000 point within, by April. Here's why. Let's look over here at this news headline. We, the headline reads, the Dow Jones Industrial Average at the current pace is on track to hit 30000 in April. You may not have heard of Aurora's second law of investing. No one knows with certainty what is going to happen next. Still with the trajectory of the Dow Jones Industrial Average, combined with investors' bullishness, the benchmark index would hit 30,000 points in April 5. What are the odds that that could happen? Well... I really do wonder what the odds are. Um, now, the Federal Reserve, um, depending on what they do on interest rates, can affect the markets. And right now, I would say the Fed is in a, between a rock and a hard place. And here's why. Um, they can't, they're in a spot where they can't really raise interest rates because that would be, uh, constricting move on banks and loans it would affect businesses and um, personal loans um, and also they can't lower it um, otherwise lending would increase it would continue to increase and we would just go further into debt which would be it would be more recklessness um, it would be that uh, there would be more pain and maybe sooner um, well, maybe not sooner. That would be delaying the pain. So anyway, the Fed is stuck between a rock and a hard place. Now, all this, I actually have this line drawn to the end of April, but maybe the beginning of April would be um, right here. So that would just be crazy insane if we reached that by the beginning of April. But it does look like it could happen, and here's how far it could go. On the RSI, we're starting to touch. Now, just from it turning up a little bit on the RSI, we've gotten from here to here. We're really just halfway there. I really believe that it's quite possible, but here's the limiting factor. Um, we have bearish divergence starting to form on the weekly chart. And this RSI could go up to here and then turn down. And how far it can turn down, well, that's the question. But um, what happens when we get to 30? I couldn't really say. I'd say we would be doing some more sideways action for the year. Something like this. But up here. Anyway, that's it for my analysis for now. We'll just have to keep an eye on it. Thank you for watching.